So what's up guys, today we have two unboxings, all BMW content, and um, this is something, um, actually both of these things are things people that watch the channel send to me, um, for specifically my BMW and stuff I've done videos kind of on, um, <clears throat> I'm going to start with the box I already opened, um, I got this a couple days ago, I haven't put it in the car but I'm thinking of doing it, um, and what's special with this, which is all this wrapping comes in the box, is uh, is this is the titanium glacial silver titanium trim. Um, a quick review on this actually, because when I got this, this really impressed me, and this is really expensive. The um, MSRP and the these two things combined is almost four hundred dollars, and that's with the employee discount. Um, and just for the trim alone, nothing comes with it, no uh, electronic parts, no, it's just the trim. But what's interesting about the glacial um, silver trim, it's actually metal. It's, it's, it's metallic, it's aluminum, um, I guess uh, coupled with plastic, plastic on the side or ABS um, material plastic. It's like a hard plastic, but it's really good quality. And both of these were uh, actually from Sarasota, Florida, BMW or Sarasota. And um, this was, I think, a customer order a couple last year in 2017 that was returned. I guess the customer didn't want it anymore. And it was just sitting around the um, the parts department. And I, I guess it was meant to be returned. It was a special order from Germany. But this comes with the uh, ashtray lid, which is very rare. You never really see the glacial silver for the ashtray lid. And the lid is also good quality metal um, coupled with the ABS plastics, which is really, really, really good quality. The only thing with this, it gets nicked real easy. And you can see some of the nick marks from, I guess it looks like the customer installed it and uninstalled it and then returned it. I'm not sure what the story is, but I'm going to bring it up and show you guys um, a better view of this. Move my camera around a bit. So what's beautiful about this, it looks bright. It looks uh, like a light silver in sunlight. Like bright sunlight right now um, in my bedroom. So you can't really see. But when you move into the sunlight, it looks really bright and polished. But when it's like sort of in a shade, it looks like a dark gray, like a charcoal, which is really cool. I like how the light plays in this. And when you move in, uh, the beauty of this pattern is like a, it's like a mesh pattern. That's very, very, very well detailed. It's almost like a um, art, in my opinion. It's like art, artwork. Um, I mean, compared to the carbon fiber trim that's more popular that you see everywhere, I think this is this is beautiful. And it got a little nick there, I guess, whenever the guy installed it or whatever. Um, surprise, BMW took it back like this. I'm not sure how that got damaged. But I got this, basically. The guy sent it to me. He saw my videos. He's like... You know, if you want, you can put this in your car. We're not, we're just going to probably get rid of it. But no one, I guess, no one came back for this. But this, the funny thing with this, this has the upgraded navigation um, hole cutout for the CIC. And it also has the convertible top switch. So this part was actually for a convertible car. Um, and like I said, the retail in this is $400 between these two. And that is with the employee discount. So, and come that the other pieces that accompany this trim is um, usually the strip that goes along the dashboard as well as the door panels. The Well, the two front door panels and the two... On a convertible, a coupe car, you get the two, um, I guess, the dummy door panel strips, whatever. So, but this is for the 335IS in the USA. I'm assuming in Europe, a lot of the non-IS cars came with this trim, but this was never really a standard or... Any kind of option on the US um, non 335 IS cars. So it's very rare. And I'm gonna see if I could install this. I'm glad it came with this because I did my Ashray lid, um, my Ashray delete, uh, whatever um, project a year ago. And actually, that's the video the guy saw and he thought I could use it. It wasn't something they're gonna use, but this is very expensive. Even if I should sell this on eBay right now, um, this is about maybe $200, even with the little slight mark in there. And that even that you can't really see it, and I'm surprised how that got damaged because this, this is very very durable. I'm not even sure how that would um, would have gotten nicked. But this is all brand new, just installed and then uninstalled, according to the guy. But I'm lucky enough to have a YouTube channel that people send me stuff like this, so you know, no complaints, um, no complaints there. Um, and I'm also lucky or happy that my channel 
sort of brings people together when it comes to um, different things, whether it be BMW talk or watches or barber jackets or uh, some of the stuff I review. Now, this is something um, <laughs> I've been chasing for a long time. And the guy that sent this to me, um, he saw my ECS unboxing of the split armrest that went really bad. And he thought it was the funniest thing he's seen on YouTube. And he had one of these. This guy actually is, um, I don't know where he's from. He's from um, Missouri. And he has an auto parts dealership. And uh, those guys in Missouri, a lot of what they do is pick up trucks and American cars. But once in a while, he gets BMW stuff comes through his shop. Um, and it's a junkyard. And um, he saw this part, and he thought of my video, and he was like, I'm going to send this to you, though. Dude, he contacted me, and he was like, um, I'm not going to be able to sell this where I am in my local auto parts store because no one down there drives BMWs or whatever, wherever he lives. Or it's not a popular thing to... Um, shit, I think I just I just went right into the box with my, with my uh, trusty... Uh, pen knife there so um lucky enough that he you know he thought of me when he this part came into the shop um now this is my second split box split armrest unboxing on the channel um not many youtube channels that do bmw stuff could say they did two split armrest unboxing and he said this part was pretty um it's good condition he is not familiar with the bmw color coding so he wasn't sure if it would match my interior but i said dude send it to me this thing is like two, three hundred dollars in the stores, and I finally got my split armrest, guys. And this is the, I believe this is the beige for the beige um, interior. And put this box to the side. And look at that, I finally got my armrest, my split armrest. So I'm gonna install these and do another video so you can see how it slides forward there. And this this bit comes up a bit, so it's it's flush. When it's closed, and when you slide it forward, it kind of comes up a bit to rest your um, rest uh, your shoulder on, and you can see the metallic. It's good quality. Wow, not makes sense why these things are so expensive, but um, yeah, this is the part, and this looks actually, dude, this is like brand new. But it was uh, he said it came off a total car. I don't know if it was an M three or or what, but this looks like it would have come out of a. Uh, a regular uh, three E nine O, but anyway, I'm very lucky to get these parts in in my hands. Um, after sort of years of looking for this and uh, the titanium glacial trim, I'll probably either do a channel giveaway for this. Um, I know people are looking for this. Even people with the three thirty five IS that want the Astray um, cubby, not the Astray cubby, but the cubby with the lid that that has the pocket. This is very valuable. Um, very rare too. I don't think. Um, I don't think you could order this now. Most dealerships won't even special order this. So I don't know who went into their dealership to, that got them to order this directly from Germany. So I'm very surprised. This might be the last one of these um, in the U.S. That, that's free, that's not in a car already or whatever, or not attached to an ashtray. So this would be a nice project for someone that wants to do that cubby lid thing that I did in my previous video. So that's it, guys. Um, I'm going to install both of these. Maybe it's the weekend now, mid late August. Um, I got some time off with my son. So I'm going to clean this up. This actually looks brand new. Dude, I lucked out on this. Because I actually paid ECS tuning when I ordered this. Uh, about two... What was it? What did I pay, guys? Uh, I think 170 or 190 And it sent me the wrong armrest. But um, but um, so lucky to get this, finally. Um, all right, that's it, guys. Enough of me talking. Uh, and... Those are my new toys, I guess, for the car. And new things are coming for the channel for the BMW stuff. I got some. I got another shifter coming in I want to install in the car. I'm not going to do the Motive Mod kit anymore. I kind of changed my mind on it. But um, I got some interesting things coming. So keep uh, stay tuned, guys. Thank you for watching.